streaming. That didn't flow that well, but you get my point. Welcome. It's six o'clock. It's Wednesday. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. Hide your kids. Hide your wife. Put your hair down, unless it looks like mine, then put it right back up. I swear I washed it yesterday. Promise swear, but then I fell asleep with wet hair and all, all hell broke loose. Hi, Susan. You know how it is. Fall asleep with wet hair, wake up with a lion mane. I think that's what happens to Bowie like every day. Every day. Ooh. Okay. There's no big thing. What? You want to come up here? You want to come up here? Okay. That the one that split? Yeah. Co-star wanted his seat. How am I today? I am fantastic. I had a super busy day. And now I'm, I'm going to art before I continue my super busy day. So I'm relaxing with a White Claw Heart Seltzer and Raspberry Flavor. Only 100 calories. Not sponsored, but if you're watching, Tink, what's up? Hi, Clara, Vamp, Trisha, Susan, everybody. Vamps out of the shadows. Weird. But I love it. Crystal. So today, it never fails. But he had a hard night last night. Just lay down, boo boo. Today, I'm going to attempt a hydro dip. Let me preface this by saying every time that I've attempted this, it turns out so not good. But Marabou has come out with um, something. They call it Easy Marble. We're going to see how easy that is because I am super great at um, making things more difficult than they actually are, comma, messing things up no matter how easy or difficult they are. Yeah, he's okay. He just, I was sick yesterday, so I didn't give him his medicine on time, so that rolled into, I guess, a lapse in his medicine, so reasons. What's up, Shane? TG? <gasps> no. Okay. I thought I lost y'all. So, so yeah. I'm going to be doing a not, um, a not requested review. Like, I did, um, my own order on this. They didn't ask me to do any, uh, no. They didn't ask me to do a review. They have no idea who I am, probably. Maybe. I don't know. Hi, Megan. And so, I'm going to try to dip this. Because, you know, why dip something small when you can mess up big? I also am going to try to dip this Mexican Coke bottle. But, man. Okay. I taped off one of the sides because I want to try to leave that like visible. Let me get some At least I'm going to attempt to leave the Coca-Cola thing thing visible. But you know, that could work. That could also really unwork. Cue the intro! <laughs> It's really stinky. Like it just has a smell that's um, 
a lot or it's like it'll get in your nose and stay there and may make you feel a little bit noshy in your tummy. So I'm just masking this off with just masking tape and then cutting out the edge of it. Apparently very wonky. Let's try to fix that up. Made it worse. Cool. Hopefully that is not a sign of what's to come in this video. Also, if you're calling me, I'm live. You cannot answer at this juncture. Sorry. So yeah, we've masked off the Coca-Cola-ness. It's such a natural for prime time. Are you talking about my amazing not makeup or or what? Okay. So I ordered from Blick.com. Uh ninety-seven dollars and fifty-three cents for the nineteen colors that I ordered. You know. Not that you guys really need to see that, but I thought I would show you. And I got these colors. And some of them are color shift, but I don't know. I don't know. Not going to focus? Cool. Don't have to. It doesn't... Like, the cap makes it look like it would be super color shifty, but the, this makes me question everything. It looks like, to be honest, it looks like their rainbow alcohol ink. And I ordered a few of these chameleon ones and they kind of all just look the same. Okay. I also, in that $90 and something, got the box of regular colors. Mainly, I got this so that I got some actual instructions from them. They smell bad. I will be selling mine brand new. Oh, thank you, TG. They work, but you have to get a stick in there to stir it up. Hey, Bug, how are you doing? I just so happen to have. Wait for it. Wait for it. Lestique. Bam. Prepared. This is trash. Okay. Uh, prep. Fill a container with plenty of cold water. Container must be deep enough. For the object to be completely immersed. I got that covered. I think. I hope. We'll see. I don't know. Uh, drip a few drops of the first color directly onto the water surface. Drip a few drops of the next color in the middle one after another. A film of paint will develop. Two or three colors is ideal. Swirl the paint using a cocktail stick to create a marble pattern. Work quickly from the dripping to the dipping. Listen, Mary Boo, if you don't have a shirt that says work quickly from the dripping to the dipping, I don't know what your merch department is doing. Next, dip the object slowly through the layer of paint into the water. The paint film on the water surface will wrap itself around the object then quickly pull it out vertically upwards. Tip, before pulling it out, blow the remaining paint to the edge of the container. This prevents colors overlapping when pulling the object out. The dipped object is ready once dry. Before dipping the next object, clean the water surface completely. The old excess paint can be removed from the surface of the water easily using a piece of head hair. And that is all the instructions that I got. If you guys have some tips, tricks, etc., about this that you feel like I should know because I feel like I should know things before I do them, but I never do the homework. So if you guys have a cliff notes for me, I would love to know. Wear gloves. 
Will do. I've seen where they use gel nail polish to do this. I've seen people use like basically printed off film. It's like they put a I've seen people use spray paint and I've seen people use like a sheet, kind of like a decal that they lay over the surface of the water. And then that works. I will be taking off all jewelry, except for my ring from Jen. Never comes off. I'll take off both of these. Put them, y'all. Don't let me forget, huh? It's on top of the Pokemon. Okay, don't let me forget. I'll freak out. What are you talking about? No. So, hi Betty. So yeah, I've seen people do spray paint. And I think we've done that on the channel where we try to do spray paint. If you try spray paint, must be a gloss. We did that test so you don't have to. Hey JJ. All right, what colors are we gonna use? Let's do, pull a white. Do turquoise, aqua spun, pink, yellow. Of course, I'm going with my standard color palette. And we'll try um, some of this. It doesn't say on here any specific prep for the color shift, like it being on a black background. So we'll, we'll test that. Yeah. When they dip tumblers, they drop the colors, then run a stick through to swirl them. These things stink. Everybody's saying that they stink. Water, big enough for the thing, check. Now, earlier we opened this and um, Jeff got it to work, but y'all, I am amazing at messing things up, so. What's up, Manuel? Get a respirator? Is it that bad? Do you have to shake them? I'm gonna shake them. Lukewarm water? No, it said, okay, so the paperwork said cold water, but the person that we were watching on TikTok that made us order this stuff made us. It didn't make us. I just got inspired to try it. Um, she said room temperature and also you're saying lukewarm water. Vogue says cold water. I need, I need a consensus. Why don't you read the directions? I did. It said cold. <laughs> You ordered the same kind as what when we were watching that live. I did. I ordered the same kind that she had. What's up, Denise? We are live right now. Good morning, since you just woke up. Understood, vamp, vamp. All right. It says if there's anything in there, you can get it out with a piece of paper. That kind of works. <laughs> Ooh, I'm scared. I'm scared. Okay, I'm scared. Let's do a couple test things before I do that. I feel like if these 
work. I'm just going to end up hydro dipping everything, including a bowie. I'm going to spray paint this white. can't even see what you're doing. What's up, y'all? What's happening? That awesome sound you hear in the background is my cutter. Clara says, ignore me. I've never done this. What's up, Shane? Uh, uh, no, don't, don't roll over. Oh, no. Just a little bit. Always look how it I see. He turned around and looked at me like, what did you say? Out of this chair. What's happening, everybody? So I was painting the skateboard deck for this guy. I painted it last night, spray painted it, and left it, and started working on it today. And the side of the skateboard deck split. No idea how or why. I'll show it to you. Luckily, I had, I had only put the sticker down and started to uh, paint it, but look at this. Never in my life have I ever seen, not even while riding a skateboard, let alone just sitting. Like, never in my life. Like, what is that? Like, it's got to be the world's cheapest deck if spray paint did that. And now I'm just worried. Like, what? <laughs> and I, I, I painted on it like I drew on it today after that happened. I was just seeing what this color would look like on there. So I didn't, none of it, the only thing was painted was black. So I didn't lose any time on it except for cutting out the stencil, wasting all that material. material. Denise said, um, you did a great job on the rings, fella. Laminate was not good and skewed. Yeah, there's no fixing it. He's actually the the sound in the background, that amazing sound. That is him cutting a new shape for the replacement board. He's actually been getting a lot of commissions uh, with Pokemon stuff. So if you guys are looking for a new avenue to get into for commish. Look into the Pokemon art right now. Right. I'm nervous. Sounds like fun at your house, right? Um, 
Ron, we have those stencils on our website. You remember this one? You want the purple one? Did you heat dry it with the heat gun? If it was plywood layers, maybe glue melt in between layers. I don't think he heated it. I think he just painted it, like set it and forget it. I mean, I've done that with other skateboards. I, I dried it with the heat gun and it's never done that. All right. It smells like enamel paint. This might be just like spray paint. find them just let me know I haven't checked the red phone so oh Clara's got you a link right there okay super we got that film that they were talking about does smell a little bit but I'm not gonna let that discourage me so that color is aqua green appropriate I think the next thing I'm going to do is turquoise. Thank you for the blesses. Ooh, that's fun. Okay, Cujo, just lay down. This feels a little bit like when you are doing... Um, When you're dripping alcohol ink into resin, which I don't know why people still do that, but it's beautiful. It's just the colors are probably going to fade. Do a swirl as instructed. Oh no. It's like sticking to my stick and I don't want it to. Alright. So let's get our dip on. Get our dip on. Ooh, that looks really fun. Okay, now that I have a practice in, I feel more confidant in doing the other ones, but I'm not gonna just jump right into that. Oh no. Yeah, gloves are a must. And then just get that in there to get it out. Okay, that's not as easy of a task. My hands are already gross. Okay. I want to do... Hi, Valerie. I just want to test this. I just want to see if we... I just want to compare a spray paint to that.
either up there or in that. Because I put it. I found it. It was laid over. This thing doesn't spring normal. So I'm gonna I just want to compare slow and added an angle. Toothpicks work better. The smell is basically like spray paint. <laughs> Don't do this inside. Save yourself. I don't understand why that's not really working. That's neither here nor there. Y'all, we'll see. I just want to have a comparison. Not the worst. All right. Now let's get real and hydrate at the big mamma jams. Dip it good. Yes, I'm. Okay. So let's try to get all this out. I'm going to use the glove. That purple keeps coming off the edges, I think. I'm not sure. I should have used that one. All right. At the end of this, when I don't need this water anymore, I'm gonna try to use a, like a metallic. I think that would be cool. All right. Let's do the Coke bottle first. Man, I thought I just cleaned this out. Just keeps coming off the sides. Whatever. Okay, let's do this. We got him and lost him. What are we talking about? Hi, Mimi! You don't need to be over here smelling this. Ooh, let's start with the aqua. What? Oh. I did that. How weird. Some of it stays together and some of it like... <gasps> Strange. I have questions. Pujo, relax. Lay down. You're a good boy. Trying to go fast because it said so in the instruction manual.
This all of a sudden looks really busy to me. And y'all know I'm not a fan of busy. It already looks marbled, but. Okay. We're gonna dip as much as we can of this Coke bottle. Oh my goodness, y'all, I think it worked. Anyway. <gasps> I did it! And I didn't even mess it up. Okay, I just messed up the bottom because I touched it. But, but, I did it! <laughs> See, look, I did it! You did it. And it doesn't look horrible. <laughs> but I touched the bottom to show people, so I swirled it, but who's gonna see? No one. I did it! Do I have to hold this till it dries? No. I just put it on wax paper, maybe. I'm gonna put it on this paper. Alert the presses. I did not mess that up. Tell everybody. Tell everybody you know. All right. Now it's time for the big guy. Should I change up the colors? What colors do you guys want me to use? Oh, sorry, buddy. I've got black, blue, green, red, yellow, ruby, dark violet, and amethyst. And silver. I forgot I got silver. Blow it off. Listen, it's still daylight. It cannot be ATD after dark. Yeah, it's just water in the container. Try the color changing. Let's do that on a, a coaster so I can see if blues, purple, and silver. Love that. Let's try a color changing one on a coaster first and I'll see what it does. Ruby amethyst, violet, black, white amethyst. Ooh, black, white and amethyst sound really good because the base is already purple. Use air to blow. Oh. All right, let's check out the color changing one. Before, I'm gonna do one on the clear and then one on uh, black background. Because usually for best color change payoff, it has to be on black surface but it doesn't Megan thank you where are you I really really appreciate that um it's after dark somewhere that it is so the instructions don't say to make sure it's on a black background but just from working with as many color changing pigments as we have, I'm just gonna get prepared. I really appreciate that, Megan. You've been with us for a while. You know how much it helps the channel. Chan Chan. All right, got a black one prepared. Got the clear one I'm about to use. Let's get all this bonus film up out of here. I'm just going to use my glove because it seems to just work better than the paper and waste not want not etc. Alright. Hey Sam. So this is the glitter green red gold easy marble color shift by Marabou. Bam. Bam. No, no bam. Okay, no bam, but you know. Mm. Bada bing, bada bam. Bada bing, bada bam. Bada bing, bada bam, bam. 
All right. So already it doesn't, okay, it's starting to do the film thing. For a minute, it was just kind of staying in dribbles. I'm just gonna, what am I gonna do? I'm not gonna do anything else. We're just doing a color test on this one, so I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna do that. I'm gonna do the thing, but I'm gonna put more of this in there. Okay. Now we're gonna do the this. And, I mean, it's on there. See that film of iridescence? But from here, it just looks, okay. So it does have some color change to it. It's very slight. It just looks like a purple interference. Unless you can catch the right color. It is a chameleon, but you can't really see it. So let's try to all right cool. I'm gonna do it on this guy it helps if you can stir it because the glitter sticks to the bottom I know I you would think that they would have a little a little marble thing in there to mix up it but it doesn't but however I, I made sure that it's not just sticking to the bottom anything for the fam you're amazing It's amazing how some dots like stick to themselves and others just get mixed up in it. All right, let's try it on the black surface and see if there's a better color payoff. Thank you for that reminder, Pamela. You don't have to donate to help the channel. You can help by just hitting the like button. Ooh, see, I don't know why they don't tell people to make sure you have it on a black background. Same exact process. But you can see it on this one, but not on that one. Blue purple, purple red. Same color. I figured it would probably be because it's transparent stuff. Okay, Miss, just lay down. My only point is, why wouldn't they mention it? Also, fun fact, I accidentally dripped some water off my hand on this, and the paint, nope, yeah. The marble stuff didn't stick to where there were drops of water. Design choice, you can get uh, funky, funky, um, by just putting a little water on before you do the dip dip and it won't stick to it. Um, I'm gonna explore that, but not on this one because we have a mission. We're gonna dip the vase, yeah, the vase. Shake it up, then double dip. I don't know if it'll stick once the surface is wet. I think you have to like dry it completely first. I don't know, didn't read that anywhere. It's just from what just happened. My brain thinking is on that. Tink, I was gonna cheers to, never mind, I'm not even gonna tell you, till after. I'll cheers to it after. Okay, so we're gonna try some amethyst. Gin germs, what's up? Are you just gonna stick to yourself right there? It's because I still love Phil. Apparently that, if it, if it doesn't like blob out, then you probably have a film left from the last piece that you did. Because it should do that. Apparently, allegedly. Should I paint this a solid color before I do it? Or leave it clear? I don't 
That's a okay. probably a color. I don't know unless you want it to be see through. JJ, thank you. <laughs> thank you, JJ. Super awesome and helpful. Ooh, let's spray paint it like black. Because those are opaque paints except for the the ones. do transfer paper stuff because oh my god sticker stuff like half the time it doesn't stick to the transfer paper how why it's supposed to stick to the transfer paper i've never had something just come off easily like it's supposed to you got any tips for transfer stuff like you think that i put oil on on this on the back side of this so that nothing would stick to it TG says she does. Uh, I'm using clear with the simple paper, and this stuff does not want to come off onto this. And it just blows my mind. Like, some parts just come off super awesome, super easy, and then it just doesn't. This doesn't make sense. But why, why doesn't it just come off? It is vinyl. It's the blue, it's the blue stencil paper. He's using the blue stencil paper and it's being not sticky when it should. Denise said, can't help you, but I stick tattoos to my grandbabies. I'm going to let this dry for just a minute. And in the meantime, let's, it's almost dry. We'll dip this one. Burnish. Rub over the back with the back of a spoon before lifting the backing paper off. He's got like a spatula. He's got a tool for that. He's got a thing. All right, so let's just test out this. Yep, that's what it is when it's when it doesn't like blob out it's because there's already a film what kind is he using I don't know just some clear transfer paper with the with red lines on it from Amazon and the, and the, the, uh, the stencil paper is from uh, what is that? O R A M A S. O R A M A S. Is that the stencil stencil paper is from? Aura mask stencil film K thirteen. I just want to see if this silver is metallic at all. It would probably be metallic over um, a white or a black solid background. You can kind of tell. Meh. All right, we really want to get all of this residue out. I wonder if this because that didn't look very opaque. I'm gonna dip over. I'm gonna dip over this one. It's just a test anyways. Just to make sure it'll cover black.
Ooh. I always use Oracle brand. Try contact paper. Have you tried Oracle? No, but I need I need it to be see through so I can see the the bottom. So I can see through it so I can see where I'm putting it. Oracle won't work because it's not see through. Unless they have see through I've tried these others and it's just I don't know. Some are just meant for other papers, I think. So I think we need to put another color with the purple. Spray paint works much better. Yeah, I just don't carry that many gloss spray paints. Also, I don't mind doing the test so people don't have to. But yeah, spray paint's cool. For foil, Iron on, I use Scissor adhesive. Yeah, that one looked pretty good because it's not busy, you know? It's when it's busy. That, I'm not the biggest fan, but this one's got that color shift even through the purple. So I guess it's not as opaque as I had thought. So I wonder if I should do it on black or if I should put s some white on here. We're gonna stick with the plan. We're gonna use, we're gonna kinda stick with the plan. We're gonna do purple, aqua, the interference, but I'm going to try a different interference. I'm with purple. I like this one. Violet, blue, green. Violet, blue, green. Violet, blue, green. Violet, blue, green. And then, okay, so we're going to do this one. Maybe some silver. And we'll base it in this deep blue color. I feel like it needs a brightness, and we'll just use white for the bright. If you wrap the piece in fishnet, would it work? Or would you spray adhesive then dip? If I had fishnet, I would totally try that. Jeff, check out Matt over at Rhinestone World. He has some great vinyls and stuff others don't carry. His transfer tape looks like it works really well. Thank you, Stacy. Okay. Awesome. I will say what this has over spray paint is that I don't have to worry about like some crazy overspray. Because you know when you spray paint it's gonna kind of kick up at you a little bit. this looks as cool as I hope it looks. Also hope that makes sense. All right, let's do a swirly do. This is not going to be as fun as that last thing that we did, but here goes nothing. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I did not account for that. Eh. Not yet. It will. How do I get the... Yeah. You just have to probably do it. <gasps> Ew. Y'all. Okay, the chameleon is legit. See how it's purple right there, but it's blue right here? This side's a little bit wild and crazy. But 
I like this smoke looking side. Huh. Okay. okay. <laughs> My hands are stuck. Okay. That's scary. Definitely should have had a bigger bucket. I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I didn't think that the chameleons would work. Simply because, why hasn't there been a chameleon spray paint? That's the end of my argument. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, I could have put more paint in, but I didn't know, I didn't know. So, the chameleon's a thing, but I highly recommend Hey, I see you. Um, Jeff, did you know that there's a place on Harry Hines? That's where it goes. Where are you going at? You're okay. So, I'll look how, hey, I'm not done yet. All the colors pretty much did what they were supposed to. Nope. Maybe? Yeah. Did what they were supposed to do. I like the darker side too. But y'all know I'm a fan of not so busy. Moose. I can't do anything with all this up here. Can I just say stuff to people first? Just take a deep breath. Lay down. Put these away. Let me just clean this up real quick, okay? You're a beautiful boy. I know. I know. I know it. So. I like how it looks when people do their like acrylic pours over vases, but I never even wanted to try it because me and 3D work never really turns out quite like it should. But these look pretty okay. I'm not upset. What I was going to cheers to earlier is me not messing things up. What's up, Tink? Okay. Happy Eve. So, yeah. I think tomorrow... Take your time, compressor. I think tomorrow I'm going to pull out the... Um, Tumblr stuff and do some of that and also I'm going to try to put um, this base on the Tumblr turner although it's probably too heavy this may just be a spray gloss to seal it type thing But I'm gonna try to turn this tomorrow and resin coat it, but if it's too heavy, I'm just gonna forget about that and spray gloss. But I'm also, I have some tumblers on order to hydro dip those. How much for the vase? Bam, if you come down here and get it, you can have it. 
clear with a sprinkle of your chameleon too. I was gonna try it with gold spray paint. I'll do it later. I still have orders to put out. Yes, sweet baby moon. Good boy. Denise, did you pick up that pup? That's yours? Yes, Chaos, oh. we did hydro dipping. And I didn't mess it up. I mean, not too bad. But as per usual, I will post this video so you guys can watch it later. Yeah, if you want to. Where's the Coke label? Oh, yeah. Thank you for the reminder, Bowie. Um, my hydro dip choice does not accentuate the label whatsoever. However, it's still there. What? It worked. <gasps> I should get one of those scratchy lotto things because I am killing it. Wait, you're not there. I almost said Coca-Cola drink fresh. That's not their thing. Anyways. I'll check it, bug. Um, thank you guys so, so much for watching, seeing what we're up to today. I hope you guys try this. If you do, make sure to tag us in ATD's Poor People, where um, all the fam gets to be inspired by each other. Check us out in all of these places. I even did this proper. It's a great day. Um, be kind to one another. You never know what someone's going through. And always remember, like always, here at ATV, we do the test. So you don't have to! You need to just start saying it. Saying what? My line too. Why would I say your line? That's because your line. You can do that. Why would I do it? You're here to also do it. Well, we both say it. Um, no. It's whatever. Anyways. Uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. I said bye.